Sussex's new trick revealed when the couple deliberately teased the royal following intimate images. Following the publication of images of the Sussexes in Santa Barbara with Harry's niece Eugenie and her husband Jack Brooks Bank in the U.S. tabloid TMZ, the topic of whether the pair, who left their royal duties and relocated to California in 2020, will fight for privacy has arisen. If they decide to go to court, the case will be added to the Duke and Duchess's long line of litigation against the press. Mark Stevens, a media law specialist at Howard Kennedy, said, they can sue. There was a case where Paul Weller sued. He was sitting outside a restaurant in Santa Monica with his children and he sued for privacy in the UK. The British singer-songwriter, whose pictures were taken in California before being published on the Mail Online, sued under UK privacy laws in 2012 and won a £10,000 payout from publisher Associated Newspapers Limited. Mark Stevens, a media law specialist at Howard Kennedy, said, they can sue. There was a case where Paul Weller sued. He was sitting outside a restaurant in Santa Monica with his children and he sued for privacy in the UK. The British singer-songwriter, whose pictures were taken in California before being published on the Mail Online, sued under UK privacy laws in 2012 and won a £10,000 payout from publisher Associated Newspapers Limited. The suggestion comes amid news of a libel action launched by the Duke against Associated Newspapers over an article. Recently, Prince Harry, Meghan Markle and Princess Eugenie received a life-changing phone call during a secret night out together, according to royal authors Omid Scobie and Carolyn Durand. At the time, Harry, 37, and Meghan, 40, were dating in secret and the Duke of Sussex's cousin Princess Eugenie was one of the very few people in the know. The 31-year-old royal regularly visited Toronto, Canada for work where the Duchess of Sussex was living at the time, and so there were a few occasions the trio met up incognito during their first four months. But the couple's relationship privacy was incredibly short-lived, as during that very night Harry received a call from his aide back at Kensington Palace. As photos of the Sussexes with Harry's cousin Eugenie and her husband Jack Brooks Bank in Santa Barbara emerged in U.S. paper TMZ, the question arises whether the couple, who quit their royal duties and moved to California in 2020, may sue for privacy. If they decided to take legal action, the case would join a list of other lawsuits launched against the press by the Duke and Duchess. The details up to the picture mum of two Meghan had already begun to paint during an appearance on Ellen DeGeneres' chat show last year. During the program, the former Suits actress revealed she and Harry had gone to a Halloween party with Eugenie and her now husband Jack, as well as some other friends. Despite mostly enjoying private dates at each other's houses and the occasional trip to a private restaurant before then, the Duke and Duchess were getting fed up of having to hide away and when the opportunity arose to go and attend a fancy dress party with Eugenie and Jack, the loved-up couple decided to go in disguise. Giggling away at the memory of her trip to exclusive Club Soho House in the city, Meghan explained of Harry, he came to see me in Toronto and our friends and his cousin Eugenie and now her husband Jack, they came as well. And the four of us snuck out in Halloween costumes to just have one fun night on the town before it was out in the world that we were a couple. Harry and Meghan should sue. Royals told to fight over Eugenie Picks, Royal, News, Express.co.uk Harry, Meghan and Eugenie had secret night out before life-changing call, authors say, OK. Magazine, say, 